everyone, welcome back. It's Marquita with Marquita LV Luxury. And on today, I have a extremely exciting video for you guys. I previously did a video on my LV tennis shoes. So on today, I will be doing a video on my LV slippers, slides. I have one wedge heel and two LV boots to discuss. I'm so excited about this video, guys. So go get your coffee, go get your tea, go get a light snack, and hurry back. Before we get started, please make sure you check out my previous videos, like, share, and subscribe. For all of you that are here that are new visiting my channel, please make sure you subscribe. We have so much fun over here. You can also visit me on Instagram at Marquita LV Luxury. I would love to be friends. Send me a DM saying hello. If you want me to do a review on a certain bag, as long as I have it in my collection, feel free to email me at marquitalvluxury at gmail.com. Let's get started. Okay, ladies, I do have my handy notes. Just to let you guys know, I will be giving you the product code name. The product code number will be in the description. I will also give you the price of each item here today. I think it just makes it so much easier. If you guys see an item that you like, you can go on the website, put the information in the search bar. Hopefully the item is in stock. If not, you can reach out to an essay or you can call the 1-800 customer service number. Give them the information that I'm providing here today. And as I say, I hope the item is in stock for you guys. Okay, let's start with the first item. The first item is the Balm Deal Flat in Monogram. These are my favorite slides in my entire LV collection. As you can see, it's a lot of wear on these items, but they're so durable. Great, great quality. As you can see at the bottom, I do wear these a lot. I wear a size 36, which is a size 6, but in the Balm Deal Flat, they do run one size small. So this is a size 37. It has the gold Harrell buckle, as you can see. And the only thing that I do hate about this is that it does, the little flap does come up on the side. I do have it to adjust it to the middle latch. So I will go back and try to adjust it so the flat, the flap here can stay down. But that is the only, I would say, thing that I dislike about these shoes with the flap. As you can see, the flap is sticking out. Um, but other than that, I rate this a 10. Um, I wear these with jeans. I wear them with shorts. These are absolutely gorgeous. I love these shoes. So again, they do run one size small. I wear a 36. I ordered these in a 37. As you can see, I do wear these a lot because they're absolutely gorgeous. I just love how the monogram shines and it stands out so much. The monogram slides were $895, which I feel is an amazing price for these beautiful, great quality slides. Moving on to the next pair of Balm Dia Flats. I'm loving the leopard print. These were $1,010. And this is in US dollars, guys. Again, I wear a size 36, so I had to get these in a 37. This is the Bomb Deal Flat Mule. So it is the same product, just different design. At the bottom, it does have um, protection for slipping. These did not. So as you can see, the bottom is different. This one is ridged. That helps with prevention of sliding versus this one that does not. So I'm wondering if that is the price difference, why the price difference, or it could be the design that's on here, which is awesome. For me, these remind me of the Jungle Collection for some reason, maybe because of the leopard print, but these are absolutely gorgeous. They don't get as much wear as my monogram, but I have worn them before. They do have the two gold hardware buckles, just as the others that I told you before. But these are absolutely gorgeous, guys. Absolutely gorgeous. 
okay? Next, these are the Bomb Deal Flat Mule. These are also um, a part of the Bomb Deal Flat family, but these are the slippers. Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Absolutely gorgeous. And for these, I paid $990 um, at the bottom. They are ridged as well. I do wear these once I come in from work. But guys, I must say, the only thing that I do not like about these is the staining, the transfer. At the bottom of my feet, sometimes it, it's black from the material. I, I have to be honest. I have to be truthful. Um, I'm guessing because of how much ink they use in the material. I'm not sure. But my feet at the bottom um, is black sometimes from wearing these. Uh, the wear is durable. Great quality material. Um, I thought when I saw these that it would have a lot of lint. Um, it would catch a lot of lint, but it has not. The only thing I can say is that the color transfer does go at the bottom of your feet if you do wear it for a long period of time in the house. So I can't wear these as often, but I do wear them because they are comfortable. So I do have my days when I just come in and I just put these on, slide them right in, and they are very comfortable and soft. These are a size 37. Remember, in the Bomb Deal Flat shoes, they do run one size small. I wear 36, so these are a 37. It does come in black and it also comes in beige. I picked the black because I just knew that they would get dirty in some type of way. So I'm absolutely happy with the color that I chose. Okay, and I love the giant LV print on the front of the slippers too. Okay, with the little flower on the sides, absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, comfortable. I will rate these a nine only because of the color transfer that gets on the bottom of your feet after the wear. But other than that, they're very, very comfortable great quality they are thick and like i said they're awesome okay the last bomb deal flat item that i will be discussing is the mink fur slippers oh my gosh i absolutely love 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 these slippers but it is a problem that i need to address I wore these one time, and as you can see, the mink started to shed after one wear, guys, after one wear. Um, I was very, very upset due to the price. I paid $1,990 for these slippers, almost $2,000. So with tax, they were over $2,000. So from the first wear, the mink at the heel started to shed yes i was very very sad they are very comfortable at the bottom it does have the ridge that helps with the sliding this is a size 37 um this is a part of the bomb deal flat family so you know it does run small but it is very comfortable very soft this does come in the brown color and it also comes in gray um as you can see, it does have the monogram stamp, the monogram LV prints in black. So, guys, I will give this a 9 as well, not a 10, only because of the mink shedding at the heel. And it's on both pair. But it is very, very, very soft. So, I do love every Bomb Deal flat that I have in my collection from the monogram. Again, the monogram was $895. This is my favorite out of the Bomb Deal Flat family. Okay, the leopard print was $1,010. The black slippers were $990. They do come in black and cream. 
in the Barmadil Flat Slippers in Mink Fur, $1,990. As stated before, all four pair in the Barmadil Flat Mule family, very, very comfortable. They do have their pros and cons, but just rating this shoe, these shoes by themselves, I would say a nine. It's not perfect, but it's not so, so bad. But I would not trade any of these. I wouldn't return any of them. I am happy to have them in my collection. I will leave the product code number to all four below. If you're interested, please reach out to an essay. Put it in the search bar online when I give you the product code number, or you can call the customer service line to see if you can get these shipped to you. Okay, let's move on to the next items. Okay, we are moving on to the LV Lock It Flat Sandals. I do have two pair. The first pair, I have the LV XL in blue. I also have the matching bag. I do have a previous video on this, but absolutely gorgeous. Oh my gosh, you can wear this with dress, jeans, shorts. I mean, I dress this up so much during the summertime. Absolutely love having this in my collection. I cannot say anything wrong about these shoes. They're absolutely gorgeous. Very, very comfortable. But in this specific shoe, I actually got a 37 and a half. So it's a seven and a half. I wear a six. So I went up one size and a half. So this is a seven and a half instead of a seven like the Bomb Deal Flats. So they do run a size and a half small um, in this particular shoe, okay? So this is the LVX scale in the color blue. They do come in red and also pink, but I have the blue never full, which went absolutely gorgeous together. Okay, this shoe was $825. So these sandals were $825. They were so popular in the summer. I'm not even sure if they're available on the website, but I will leave the product code number below. If you do want to reach out to your SA or customer service line or um, search on the website, you're more than welcome to do so. I have the Locket Flat Sandals in monogram with the gold buckle on the front absolutely gorgeous i also have this in a 37 and a half meaning they do run one size and a half small so i had to go up wear these a lot i wear these more than the scale blue um i even have a, a recent picture on instagram with me wearing these they're very very comfortable just like regular flip-flops um fit me perfect i love wearing these so i wear these all year round Okay, and these were only $800. The SKL Blue were $825, and these were $800. Please, please, please go a size and a half up. I also have wide feet, so I'm not sure if that makes a difference, but these are very, very narrow, as you can see, and I have a wide foot, so I went up a size and a half which was perfect for me. They do not slide off. They fit perfect. Okay, this particular sandal, I saw it on the website. I saw it in khaki and monogram. I wanted it so, so bad, but when I reached out to my essay, they no longer had the khaki color. They had the black color, which I'm showing you here. These are the Sun Bath Flat Mule Sandals. And I absolutely dislike them. <laughs> that is correct, guys. I do not like these sandals. I tried so hard. I don't even know why I did not take them back. But um, it just slipped my mind, basically. I put them back in the dust bag. I put them back in my shoe box. And I left them there. Um, I previously bought them back out. Um, and try to love on them again. I always give my shoes in bags. If I'm kind of iffy with them, I always try to give them a second or third try. I tried these twice. The first time, I disliked them, I mean, a lot. <laughs> um, they were just beautiful on the website. And so I tried them again, and I still felt the same. 
no feelings change. So I might give them a third round just to see. It's way past the 30 days. Um, so I know I can't return them. Maybe I'll give them to a, my sister or again, um, my daughter feet is already my size already. So I might just keep these for her. But again, these called the Sun Bath Flat Mule. They were $540. I wanted the khaki and monogram, but this is what they had in stock. Um, in this size, I wore a I wear a 37. So instead of the 37 and a half, I only had to go up one size in these. So make sure you look at that. In this in the flat mules, I wear 37 and a half in the flats. But if you're interested in the sun bath mule, just go up one size versus one size and a half. Guys, these shoes are extremely heavy. Heavy. <laughs> extremely, extremely heavy. Um, it's just not a good relationship between me and these shoes. But they're in my collection. Um, they, they look absolutely gorgeous. I love the shiny black against the monogram. I love the thick sole, but they're heavy. Um, my feet is already wide and this and they made them look wider. I just did not like them at all. As you can see, I have tried to wear them. Um, they have not just sat on the shelf in a dust bag. I tried to wear them and I absolutely dislike them. But hey, they're here. I will leave the product code number. Again, this is a 37, not a 37 and a half. So go one size up from your normal size. I wear a 36, this is a 37. I will leave the product code number below. So you can try to order these if you are interested. Okay. Let's move along to the beautiful, oh my gosh. This is my favorite, favorite heels, guys. I love these wedge heels. These are the LV Passenger Sandals. Oh, look how beautiful they are. Look how beautiful they are absolutely gorgeous i do wear these a lot you can wear these with shorts um dress jeans dress it up dress it down i absolutely love these wedge heels um the passenger sandals was one thousand one hundred and ninety dollars i got these in a size 37 meaning they do run a size small i wear a 36 these are a 37 I love the gold hardware on these item, on this item. So, so creative, so beautiful. Um, I do have this on my Instagram page. I did match this with the Dolphin bag and it went perfect. I even love the sole of the shoes right here, the gold. It just brings out so much. Get the wedge heels. And when I say comfortable, these are the most comfortable LB shoes in my collection. Even out of the tennis shoes, these shoes are so comfortable. I will rate these a 10. I will most definitely rate these a 10. I can't speak highly enough on this sandal. Again, this is the passenger sandal, wedge heel. It does have a buckle closure absolutely gorgeous look at the beautiful beautiful monogram you can pair this with so many different bags but it absolutely goes perfect with the dolphin bag okay i will leave the product code number in the description if you feel like this is something that you want to have in your collection feel free to reach out or go check the website because they are in stock on the website Okay, let's move on to the boots. Okay, guys, I just did a previous unboxing on the Cherie boots. Oh, so I have to admit, guys, I did wear them. I told you guys I would come back with a review. When I say wear them, I mean I put them on for like 45 minutes and my feet were hurting so bad. So, so very bad. Um, I do love these shoes. I got these in a 36 and a half. I will be reaching back out to my SA. I will go up to a 37 when I try them on. 
the 36 and a half fit perfect. I tried them on. I even showed you guys the picture um, on Instagram. They fit perfect when I was in the store when I went to go pick them up. Came home, tried to wear these, and I mean, I lasted about 45 minutes. My feet are wide, as you can see. These are more narrow. I think I should have known better. It was totally my fault, not my SA. Um, I should have got a 37 to even begin with. A 37 is in stock, um, not on the website. You actually have to call the 1-800 number or reach out to your SA. This is a 36 and a half, guys. It's very, very narrow. Um, everything else fit perfect. It was just around this area where my feet is wide. So it started aching a bit, but these shoes are absolutely gorgeous when you put them on. I had on all black. Of course, I love black and monogram. I had on all black, added these beautiful, beautiful boots with the monogram belt to match, and it was perfect. The perfect outfit, so easy. It went perfect together. Just having that monogram on the tilt bring these boots out so very much. Um, for these boots, I paid $1,190. A few sizes are available on the website. Um, like I said, reach out to an SA, reach out, call the customer service number, guys. They are gorgeous. When you put them on, they are absolutely gorgeous. I love the thin heel. The point is absolutely gorgeous, guys. But I need to go one size up, except for a half size. So when I tried them on the store, maybe I didn't have them on long enough just to see how it felt. But once I got home and I tried to wear them, I could not last more than 45 minutes. So I wear 36. I need a 37 in these beautiful boots. Zipper closure as well. Stretchy material. So you don't have to worry about it fitting around your ankle at all, going up to your ankle. Everything's perfect. Only thing I would say, these shoes are very narrow, so be careful with sizing. I would say go a one size up instead of a half size, like I made a mistake and did. Okay, let's move on to our last pair of shoes. I say the best for last. These boots just not trying to act right. But I say the um, best pair for last, which is my, oh my gosh, I love these so, so much. Oh. Uh, the Star Trail Ankle Boots. So comfortable. So comfortable and gorgeous, guys. I love the wedge heels. So I'm guessing it's just something with me and wedge heels. With me having a wider, um, having wider feet because the passenger sandals was wedge heels and these Star Trail boots are wedge heels. So I'm just guessing it's more comfortable for me which I absolutely love. The black with the monogram, oh my gosh, is a plus. In these shoes, I got a 36 and a half. So I went a half size up from my normal size, which is a six, a 36. Guys, just look at that black and monogram together. I love, love the bottom. They're like army comeback boots but just classy and styled up. I love the zipper on the side. Guys, I will rate this these boots a 10. Go out and get these boots, ladies. You will not be disappointed. Okay? I will leave the description, um, the product code number in the description, guys. Reach out, get these boots. You will not be disappointed. Go a half size up. You will love, love, love these boots. I can't describe how much I love them. Um, I would say out of these and the Shree boots, I will most definitely pick the Star Trail boots over these boots. Very, very comfortable. So I do give these a 10 plus. I absolutely love them. That's why I saved them for last. I'm absolutely wearing these tomorrow as well. So guys, go out and get these boots. Do not second guess yourself. Go a, a half a size up 
go purchase and add these to your LV collection. Okay, guys, that wraps it up. Like I said, I already went over my LV tennis shoes. I do have a video on that, but today I wanted to solely go over my LV sandals, slippers, my one pair of wedge heels, and my two pair of boots. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Please, please, please like, share, subscribe to my new viewers. Come on over. We have a good time over here. Visit me on Instagram at Marquita LV Luxury. Send me an email if you want me to review a certain bag, any shoes, um, sandals again, anything that you would like to see on this channel, please feel free to email me at MarquitaLVLuxury at gmail.com. Guys, be safe out there. Be blessed. Happy holidays. I love you all. Mm -hmm. Until next video. See you later.